B. You called. <laughs> Promised I'd call, didn't I? Promising's one thing, keeping it's a whole other bag. So, managed to learn anything? Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dog goes by fingers. Oh shit. Know where to find this Fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off Jig Jig Street. Fuck V. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, all right, later V. Oh my, the place has a wicked vibe. So, there's more up your alley than clouds? Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Here, Katie, Katie, what's the rush? Free fuck off! Yeah? Gear looks a little basic, but it works. So he didn't ask for any money? Nada? Not even installments? Like I said, he just finished and said... Well, well, what do we got here? And you just the cutest thing. If you're looking for a release, I just might be your man. Looking for a ripper duck. Goes by fingers. Know where I can find him. Who's asking? And why? Got a problem with an implant. Not from around here. Couldn't find another ripper in the city to patch you up? Heard fingers was the best. Yeah. The best for joy girls. Are you a whore? No, but you are, from the look of things. Yo, you hear what this bitch said to me? Best watch your tongue. I'd say it again, but what for? Your little skull sponge can't possibly get its gray cells around it. Best apologize for that bitch! <laughs> Gotta be worth a damn to get an apology from me. And you're trash. Not worth shit. Nobody talks that way to little loco. Woo! <laughs> That's... Right! You get him, girl! Hey! Hands off! Her. Think I'm scared of your skinny ass? You will be when every mox in town descends on this shithole. You got a financial claim? Take it to court, you Fuck pussy. Off and leave me be! Fine, I get it! Everyone's got their breaking point. Just pay me what you owe me, and you can fuck off the greener pastures. <laughs> I don't owe you shit. <laughs> oh, but you do. And that shit has a name. Something around 20 thou. What? Come on, you pulled that number out of your ass. Hey, what's that tone with me, you skank? Hey, look in the mirror. Who paid for all that? Think Fingers would have fixed a cracked face plate for free? You want out? You gotta pay me back. Hope that teaches those candy ass scotch hey. suckers not to come around here no more. Hello? There's a line. Nuh uh. You ain't cutting. Sit your ass down and wait Fingers your turn. Down. You know him? Heard some things, yeah. Like... His hand sometimes slips. Glad to see a familiar face. I'm worried sick about her, V. 
I had no idea anything had happened. We'll find her. I know we will. After the heist, Evelyn holed up with the Mox for a while, right? That's right. So why the hell did she go back to Clouds? <laughs> Thought she'd be safer there. God knows why. Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. Mox don't happen to have fingers in their crosshairs. No, why? Her joy toys come out of his clinic in worse shape than they come in. Yeah, well... Can't solve all the world's problems at once. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls? See if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. She means a lot to you, doesn't she? And you've arrived at that conclusion how exactly? Moment you knew where she was. You sprang into action. Once you get close to Evelyn... You never want to let her go. You worked at Clouds. Not as a doll. Tuned their virtues. That's where I met Ev, Tom, and the rest of the crew. Think Evelyn's being kept here somewhere? On the one hand, hope she is, because I want her back fast. But on the other, hope to God, no. Because who knows what that sick fuck could have done to her. You seen a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here? No idea. Gotta ask him. Here. Saw to cover you for some real chrome. Try to from a real ripper. Lips, you if you're flush enough to afford a real reaper, uh, then what are you doing here? Hell do you Come care? She's here cause she feel like it. Now thank the lady unless you and me no, Delta. Can't see nothing but a blur. Come on, let's go. Had a longer face than you. Edges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. Your eyes. I think he's done. We're going in. Eventually. Yes? Hello. What can I do for you? Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. I knew she was here in your... clinic. Ah, oh, so that's what this is about. Where is she? Ah, oh, a loaded question if I've ever heard one. You, Tiger Claws? As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the Mox. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants. You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck. Know that? You're looking for a friend? <laughs> Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised, patted. To feel like I'll be more than glad to show you around. Of course. I can't remember each and every one. Even if it... Forest. May mean anything to you? Nope. They call him Woodman. Works at the dollhouse. You... You talk to him? Didn't like Woodman's tone. So I made sure he'll have a tough time speaking for a while. 
Not too fond of you either right about now. So careful what you say. Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. Mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what, exactly? If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Nothing. Damage was caused by a netrunner using homebrewed malware. Sounds about right. Get to the point! The point? Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. Don't talk to her like that. She insulted me! Look, the quicker you spill, the shorter you'll have to put up with us. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? Could very well be on her way to becoming the next underground brain dance, darling. That's all I know. What do you mean by underground? I don't know. I mean, I don't watch that sort of stuff. Snuff? XBDs? I told you I don't know. You sure about this? Four days I had her here. She was out cold in La La Land for practically every minute. It wasn't a slumber party. We didn't have pillow fights and promised to send each other postcards. Where will we find her? How many times do I have to repeat myself? I don't know. I, I did what anyone in my place would do. When I realized I wouldn't be able to help her, patch her up, I called my fixer. Two guys came and picked her up the same day. Who'd you call? Who's your fixer? Wikako. Told her I had a busted doll with a BD implant to hand off. Where did they take her? I told you already. I don't know. They weren't the talkative kind, and I'm no gonk. I know better than to ask questions of people like that. You're no gonk? What do you think? Why do all these girls come in here, let you grope around them? Think it's for your charm? Your caring attitude? They do it because they got no choice. And in the end, they despise you. They can smell These guys, what did they look like? Like you, me, anyone else in this city. Really now, they looked like you. They looked like the kind of guys you don't make eye contact with. One of them was a bearded fellow. The two that came for her didn't say anything about where they'd take her, what they were going to do to her. Mentioned something about virtues with a moth, of all things. Said she'd be perfect for them, whatever that means. But that's really all I know. You ponder off like she was some fucking inanimate mannequin. Because that's exactly what she was. Need air. I'll be outside. Judy's right. People like you make this city a living hell. Day in, day out. Got what you wanted, didn't you? So get the fuck out of here! I let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her. I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together! Wanna give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. 
better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's head symbol bring anything to mind. Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. It makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction and one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Think I'll try calling Wakako. Fix your fingers mentioned. Thought of an angle to run on her? Why would I need one? Even if she knows the studio's location, she's not gonna spill. Be putting her neck on the line. <sighs> okay. I'm buying the brain dance. We can analyze. Play detective. Fine. Meantime, see if I can't find something on the NCP domain. I'll wait in the van. V, nice surprise. What is it you need? How's things, Waco? Is it prelude to whatever illegal favor you're about to ask me? What? Never. In that case, they couldn't be better. Kind of you to ask. And you? Looking for a brain dance. Oh, any particular one? Logo on the casing? A death's head moth. Whoa, now. That's quicksand. So I would advise caution. Know who makes them? Where they scroll them. And do you know what a fixer does? Allow me to explain. Not only do I finalize transactions, I can accomplish the goddamn impossible. Which would be... Making sure the buyer, supplier, and ever-neglected intermediary not only keep their heads in the gains, but keep their heads, period. So don't you ever ask me who, with whom, where, when, why, or how. <laughs> Can you get me one of those recordings? No, but I have a pretty good idea who can. Who'd that be? There's a store on Jig Jig Street. It has a Pandora's box worth of crap in sight. Try asking the owner. Thanks, Waco. Looking for something raw, untouched. Raw's all you get with me. What's your edge? I want something that'll floor me, really scramble the neurons. And we've got it all, man. Bare knuckle boxing. Shootouts, black ops, interrogations, amputations. No, 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 no. I mean, something like, well, you know. Fetishes. No, come on. You know what I mean? No, I don't. Think I'd be doing this job if I could read minds? I want to know what it's like to, to kill somebody. See, wasn't so hard. So, got some classics from the last Corp War, or armed robbery if you're looking for something fresher. 
What are you looking for? What have you got? Virtues. Any special kind? Well, let me put it to you this way. Those who know, don't need to ask. Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? You a badge? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head'll cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. Where do you get these scrolls? People that make these? <laughs> Obsessed with privacy. Never even occurred to me to ask where they're from. To which caution I probably owe the fact that I'm still alive, talking to you. Got anything that might interest me? Pleasure doing biz with you. prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. I want you to describe what you see. You might catch something that you V, editing mode's good to go. Dig around all you want. Scav, gotta be. No one else with that kind of fashion sense. Ordered recently. Electric cork patch on the coveralls. Ordinary box. Decker, Tanaka, and Rogers logo. Standard for a trash heap. Scab woman. Who knew that sides chopping people up, they were scrolling XBDs. Can't beat that rich synth cough aroma. Cheap shit. Cold too. Mm-hmm. Buck a slice. Coffee was cold. Like, from the day before. Pizza looked fresh, though. So? Means someone's grabbing buck a slice regularly. Which is not something one does for the flavor and fresh ingredients. Pizza shares its DNA with styrofoam. Nobody's gonna schlep across town for it. Okay. We're looking for an electric core power plant located near a bucket slice. EC used to have a big old complex in Charter Hill. Bucket slice chicks out too. How can you be sure though? Here we go. Old electric core power plant in Charter Hill. Gotta make do with that for now. Nothing else to garner from this school. No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me? 
Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the death said moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. They'd have to be utter gonks to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. I'm